Deciding whether or not your company is a candidate for a REIT conversion is a significant decision process that needs to be addressed. Most companies can evaluate what the consequences could be on a modeling point of view in terms of what do we look like now, what will we look like afterwards, but it's critical to look at all the aspects of the decision process. Right from the very beginning, cultural implications will be affected, uh, so we need to have a full array of issues identified and evaluated. And once we can come to grips with deciding whether or not to move forward with this type of transaction, then we get into the actual analytics of it. A typical REIT conversion process from start to finish is a significant endeavor and can take anywhere from six months to two years. And when I say a significant endeavor, that endeavor starts with the overall culture of the firm being evaluated as to whether or not you feel that you can separate your assets from your company. Once you get over that threshold, then there's a whole litany of issues that have to be resolved. Legal, accounting, and tax, all related to the transaction and whether or not the assets can be separated, and if they can, how do we do it, and how do we structure the new entity that's going to house the assets. KPMG has been involved at the very beginning of the decision process and gets involved in every step of the way in terms of each aspect of the equation that has to be solved in order to make the transaction a complete success, not only for the company, but for the shareholders, which is ultimately the true test of whether or not the transaction was successful.